Hello and what is up guys, Jack here and this is episode 23 of the Squad Builder series and in this video I'm going to be you know, showing you around this special team and it's special because I have a legend card and I opened him in a pack um, about a week ago, just over a week ago now so if you want to go and check that video out you can do so, it should be pretty obvious which video it is. Um, but now prices of this team will be very expensive and it will change depending on when you're watching this video. So I'm going to estimate this team to roughly be around 3.1 million coins at the point of making this video. Uh, but before I get into the stats of this team, let me know in the comment section below if any of you can build a nice hybrid with Romario. Leave it in the comment section below and I'll check it out. And if you do enjoy this type of squad builder, don't forget to drop a like on this video. Let's see if we can get 250 likes before I upload a, a Romario player review, which will be out later today if we hit 250 likes. So make sure you hit that like button. Also want to say a quick shout out to FIFA Coins today. They sell cheap Ultimate Team Coins. You can also get a further 10% off any purchases from their website by using my discount code EzekielG. All the links will be in the description, guys. Um, but without further ado, getting into the squad in goal, we have Julio Cesar, very decent keeper. Debatable whether he's the best Brazilian keeper, but I prefer him over any other Brazilian keeper myself. Let me know what you think about that. I know there's Helton and Diego Alves as well, which you could possibly use. Um, but anyway, moving into the first centre-back, we have David Luiz, who, as you should already know, is an absolute tank. Uh, very strong, fast, and exceptionally good in the air as well. Um, so now moving onto the right side of the defence, we have Thiago Silva, a very well-known beast as well. Just This team is full of beasts, but basically he's probably the best centre-back in the game. It's debatable, but he has 80 pace, 87 defending, and 83 heading. But for such an awesome play, you can also get him under 25,000 coins now, which is absolutely crazy. When I bought this player about a week ago, I thought he'd be at least 50,000 coins plus. So, uh, yeah, this team's actually quite affordable if you take out Romario. Uh, but anyway, now moving into the left, or over to the left side, we have Miranda. Again, a very beastly defender. 76 pace, 80 defending, 80 uh, heading. Now moving over or up to the left wing back, we have Louise with 83 pace, 79 dribbling and 81 defending. Um, again, a very good uh, left back. I usually use my silver Rafael Martino, but I've wanted to change it up and have a full gold team. Um, but moving into the centre mid position, we have uh, Ramirez, who can be played as a CDM if you uh, don't want to move him, like move his position if you like, uh, because he has a strong links with uh, uh, David Luiz at the moment. Ramirez, as you all know is just a very common player in pretty much every BPL team and also every Brazilian team is very common player. Uh, it's just great at everything. It's just, uh, it's you, you don't even need to explain it anymore. It's just a great player. Uh, but anyway, on the right side of midfield, we have a player I actually haven't used before since FIFA 12. So I really was excited to use him. And he turned out to be a very godly player for me. Very important in this team because his shooting and passing and dribbling is everything that um, Ramirez kind of lacks, if that makes sense. So his passing is very important to put through uh, Romario, Hulk, and well, I've just ruined who else is in the team. Don't want to say who else is in the team, but um, he's very important to uh, pass. And he's also got a great shot on him as well as four-star skill. Moving up to the right wing position, I've already said it. We have Hulk and he is possibly the best right wing in this game. Let me know your opinions on that. It would be quite um, interesting to see what you think about that. He's definitely the best uh, Brazilian right wing for me. Uh, but he has insane pace and strength and also just agility. His shooting as well, his passing, his skills just makes him a complete right wing. And you can play him, play him as a striker or a right wing. It doesn't matter. He will score you goals from wherever you play him. And... Um, Anyway, now moving over to left wing position, we have William, another Chelsea Brazilian player with 88 pace, 88 dribbling and 4 star skills. So very um, very hard player to kind of tackle because those scoop turns are going to be very effective and he's going to be quick as well. Use him in a squad builder before so you should know my opinions about him. Uh, but he's a very good player, again manages to get into great positions and shooting wise he's okay but uh, he's also good at crossing in as well to Hulk. Someone like that is uh, still going to score your goals. Uh, but now moving into the position you guys have been waiting for, it is a Romario who currently goes for roughly 3 million coins. I'm not sure if his price is going to go up or down, I have no idea. Legends are a lot rarer on the uh, market, so is that even a word, rarer? He's a lot rare, a lot more rare on the market, so yeah, I'm not sure what's going to happen about him. But I don't want to give any kind of insight to how what I think of Romero because I will be doing a player review of him later on today as long as we hit 250 likes on this video. So go and hit the like button and you'll see a player review later on today which I'm quite excited to be giving you. 
So that's it guys, this team is insanely good. I know it's using a five at the back formation, but for me, I found Romario really hard to kind of work into other formations and other strikers, you know, you've got to play a 4-3-3 or a five at the back formation. That kind of thing where he's the only striker or maybe he's just a centre forward, but this team works really well together. The work rates are great. The uh, just each player has its own individual role. For example, Hernandez is the passer of the midfield. Ramirez is like the hard worker and um, Hulk is just uh, someone that just beasts it up the right wing and takes takes the pressure off Romario basically and uh, Romario is just a clinical finisher. I don't want to give too much away about him though. So uh, until next time guys, here are some goals to score with this team. Don't forget to drop a like and I will see you guys later. Bye.